Yo, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Ooch, and of course, we are back again. Once again, how y'all doing today? So today, we're going to be finally taking some time to look at some brand new footage of Street Fighter 6. And I say brand new because it is brand new to me. I'm sure a lot of y'all might have already seen this, but if not, then I hope you guys enjoy my commentary and basically just my thoughts on everything that we're going to be looking at brought to us by Game V. And this is 10 minutes worth of footage. So let's get into it. <laughs> the face feature is actually really cool. I do enjoy it a lot. I can't wait to actually take advantage of it myself. That's going to be really funny. All right, so here we go. So from what I've heard, I've heard that Chun-Li is actually really, really, really good in this game so far. Oh, that was a nice grab. Yeah, a lot of her normals seem to come out pretty fast. Oh, the spinning bird kick. <laughs> oh, it's just, it's just sometimes you got to do it. Oh, nice block on the EX there. Uh, I have to get used to not calling it EX. Because not, they're not EXs anymore. Wow. Oh, shutting it down. Okay, that was a good grab punish. Oh, okay. Yeah, Chun-Li seems like she's very fast. She has a lot of uh, overall. She's, she's just pretty much in control for the most part. Rising uppercut. Look, 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 looking a little shook in this match. Ooh. That's an awkward grab. The way, just, just the way, like, the animations are and stuff. Like, how, how he actually grabbed her and, like, put her on the, on the ground. Oh, man, he's whiffing these, these, <laughs> these DPs heavy. Oh. That was interesting. It was like it was like uh, she was make, trying to make a hard read, baiting something that would have uh, kept her safe from what it looked like. Okay, went right through her Kikoken. That Kikoken, her walk speed still seems like it's really fast. Nice rising uppercut. Wow. Combo into spinning bird kick. Now, I'm not, yo, I don't, I, I feel like, and I, I, you know, I, no, I'm pretty confident when I'm saying this. Spinning bird kick is moving in the EX version. Good punish, but not enough. Punish counter. Oh. Light. She's calling them lightning kicks now, I notice. Oh, nice hit confirm. Very nice to confirm. Ooh, wow. Imagine trying to react to that. Ooh, ooh, the parry. Nice. Okay, good punish counter and the counter hit. Oh, didn't get any kind of follow-up. Oh, nice. Okay. Bringing it back, Luke. Still in there. I like it. I definitely like it. So I said this on Twitter, Luke gives me the Johnny Cage vibes in this game. Like the way he the way he is, his personality, the way he carries himself. He just get, like just put a pair of sunglasses on him and dude, this is our sweet Johnny Cage. Like real 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 talk. All right, so my man Jamie versus Rio. These are most likely going to be the two characters that I put the most time into, but we're going to have to see obviously because I'm sure the roster will change. Nice. Nice. All right, so notice every time he gets he makes a successful parry, he does replenish that one bar. Ooh, nice. Okay, good block. Nice. Okay. Hey. So it seems like you know I, I know I made a video talking about how if Jamie is gonna possibly bring bring Yoon and Yang back into Street Fighter Six, but I feel like Capcom low key made Jamie so that they can just combine the best of both worlds into one character. Which, I mean, is whatever. But I, you know, me personally, I would love to just see my man Yoon come back, obviously. Because I'm more of a Yoon than a Yang guy. But, because it looked like, it looked like, hold on, that was disrespectful. You see how he was just stepping on his damn freaking ponytail like that, Ryu? That's crazy. Nice parry. 
Oh, he tried to do it there too. It was too, li too late. Oh, trying to squig mid combo. I feel like uh, sometimes you could you could tell. Oh, that was a oh that was a beautiful follow up after that low sweep move. Ooh, dude, those parries are sick. So with the, the way the parries work in this game, you can actually hold the parry input, and as long as you have the the, the bars for it, you'll just keep parrying everything. So you got to be smart as to when you actually do it. There you go. Nice, nice. Ooh, ooh. Oh, grab them. Okay, interesting. The jump animation, like the way, the way they flip, I feel like they're going for a more realistic type. Oh, nice Denjin charge. Oh, the parry. Parry into the what the FADC look alike. Don't worry, guys. Uh, we're gonna be doing a lot of these videos, so I will make sure that I actually learn the terminology. Uh, <laughs> the you know, obviously, the sooner the better, of course. This stuff on Ryu. I definitely want to see more Jamie matches. Here we go. My asking you shall receive, I guess. All right, going for some some uh, classic bread and butter Ryu. Nice low sweep. Jamie trying to get something to stick. He does, looks like he does have a follow up after that low sweep, like we saw in the last round. Oh, okay, the solar plexus. That forward hit, forward heavy punch. I didn't go for it that time. Now goes for a grab. All right. We're staying in this corner. This is a great spot. Oh, nice super. But he's getting blocked on the entire thing. It looked like there's a little window. Oh, now that's something that I've been doing in Street Fighter V. EX Donkey Kick into EX Shoryuken for some nice damage. Ooh, okay. Now that looked like a grab. So that's probably why that, you know, all of that. Oh, now notice. Okay, so you see how Ryu is all gray. That's why. That's because he has no, um, he has no meter at all the uh the drive system he has no drive he's burnt out or is it is it burnt i don't know we'll, we'll we'll figure it out we'll figure it out as we go oh yes i'm glad that they kept that that's iconic uh oh just seeing tatsumaki completely whiffed but not a proper punish there it is okay good sweep again oh that focused attack grabs him oh okay nice ex Gets, gets himself out of the corner. Gets, has the opportunity to squig. Now, I wonder if he gets dive kick after he squigs once. Because as far as I know, uh, the way the devil inside, which is the technique that Jamie uses when he drinks, that uh, gives him more moves the, the drunker he is. That's how it works. Oh, nice. Okay, that jump in. Oh, but the focus attack. Just blown it up in his face. Look, man. You can look. Look, in, look, look, look. Master Ryu. You can't sleep. It's Master freaking Ryu, okay? Uh, uh. I like the pressure from Jamie. Sometimes you just gotta do it. Nice. Okay. The hard knockdown. Oh, but he, oh, that punish counter. And I'm, I, I, I didn't pay, let me see. You know what? Let me, let me, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't want to like interrupt the match flow, but I just want to take a look and see how much that actually costs. I'm pretty sure that's supposed to be at least three bars. Let's see. So he did an EX that cost him two. Oh no, I didn't go back far enough. Oh no, it's actually after this, I think. Right. Oh no, he's has the parry charge. Wow. So when you hold the parry, you still gain all of that that bar back. So for multi, yo, honestly, multi hit moves are actually probably, um, as long as you're able to try and uh properly punish them you're gonna freaking you're, you're gonna give your opponent all that meter back oh oh dude i didn't even have enough time to even acknowledge the fact that jamie had it looked like he was in full uh devil inside mode so he has full meter so this will be easy to see right here so it looks like it costs two actually not three if i'm looking at the right side yeah so it does replenish over time actually that, 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 that costs one that's crazy okay well 
All right, now we know. All right, guys, so that was your first of many of these uh, gameplay breakdowns and commentary for Street Fighter VI. Like I said, I will be doing this as often as I possibly can. And funny enough, there's a lot of YouTubers out there that were fortunate enough to actually get the opportunity to play Street Fighter VI early. I'm hoping that they allow this to be a thing at EVO this year because usually that's the place where you want to obviously debut or have some sort of demo for the people to play because there's gonna, literally going to be thousands of people going to evil like they do every time and you know what better place to allow the public to get their their hands on it and get more content out there in 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 the ecosystem so uh good stuff to game v thank you for the footage i do appreciate it and uh if you guys have any other gameplay that you guys would want to see me check out definitely leave it in the comments below or hit me up on twitter or join my discord so that way i can check them out because like i said i will be doing daily content as best as i can for street fighter 6 and street fighter in general because i have been playing a lot of five and some mods on my channel over at twitch so definitely check me out there and of course like share subscribe hit me up on twitter like i said all that supporting links are going to be in the description as always make sure you guys are taking care of yourself may the power protect keep it locked right here on this channel stay safe stay clean stay inside i'll see you guys in the next one